Hey guys, what's up? This is Oakley. Keep back with another video. Before this video gets started, please leave a comment down below. That would be awesome because I make reading your comments videos. So if you guys leave a comment on this video or any other video, it'll go into reading your comments video 100% guaranteed. So please go ahead and do that. But today is a pretty cool day because um, the we are going to be going over the Broncos schedule. It came out yesterday. I tried to do a video yesterday, but it came out kind of late. So I wasn't able to uh, do that, but I am making a video about it today, so let's get right into it. So here is the schedule for 2018-2019 season for the Broncos. Uh, so quickly, I'm just going to say what the games are. Um, first game, uh, week one, it will be against the Seahawks, then the Raiders, then the Ravens, then the Chiefs, then the Jets, then the Rams, then the Cardinals, then the Chiefs again, then the Texans, then the Chargers, then Steelers and Bengals, then uh, San Francisco, then the Browns and the Raiders, and then the Chargers again. All right, so I guess I'll I'll just start going over these uh, right away. Um, very in, kind of an interesting week one will be against the Seahawks. We have not played them for a while, um, but we are playing the Seahawks this year. Um, I, I, we, it's a home game, so that that's an advantage. I think that'll be kind of a hard game to start off with, um, but I, I I don't know. I get I I would see honestly. I would see us losing, but I haven't seen our team since uh, last year, so um, our, our team is much different, so I really don't know how that's going to um, turn out. But um, th this year, there was a few a few um, NFL people saying that we have one of the easiest schedules, but I, I disagree. I think there's some um, parts, like right here, that um, are not going to be that easy, but uh, going through... Uh, I'll just go through them now. So, and then um, Raiders week two at home. Um, I think the Raiders might. I think the Raiders going to be worse than they were last year. And the Raiders weren't that great last year. Um, we were able to beat Raiders um, in one of the games. So, because they got rid of a lot of players this off season and and they didn't really gain much. I think they. I, I know they signed a wide receiver. I can't think of it right now, but. Yeah, and then Ravens, I think we should be able to win this game, Um, so that, that's kind of a easier game, not super easy, but there you go, and then Chiefs, I think the Chiefs, Um, I think we'll definitely win this game because we're at home, uh, again, I shouldn't say definitely because I, I, I don't know what could happen, but the Chiefs, I think, are going to be worse this year, they obviously do not have Alex Smith, Um, they have a lot of faith in Patrick Mahomes, and I, I, I don't know, Uh, I, I don't think he's good, but... Maybe I'm wrong. The Chiefs are right through all this, but I, I just don't feel like Patrick Mahomes is going to be better than Alex Smith at all. Um, but we'll see. And then the Jets, um, I think we should be able to beat them. And then the Rams, I think we're we're going to definitely lose, actually. Uh, I, I, again, I can't say that. I really don't know how our team is going to be. I'm just, just predicting, I guess. Um, but Rams, Rams, um are just stacked after this offseason. They were a playoff team before this offseason. They lost in the playoffs, but now they just stacked their defense. Oh, my gosh, their defense is going to be so amazing this next year. It's insane. Uh, but this will be an interesting game. Keeps Lieber turning home. Uh, probably going to get booed or something. I don't know. That will be interesting to see that happen. If we were able to win that game, that would be amazing. Then Cardinals, um, I think we should probably be able to win that game. I I, I don't really know, but I, I feel like we should be able to. Chiefs again, but uh, with division games, uh, home field advantage matters a lot. So I, I think we should definitely be be able to win this game and this game. Um, not so sure about pretty even. Uh, whether I think uh we'll win or lose, and then the. This is um, this is kind of the the five five six the our ending weeks is just kind of what I'm worried about. Oh, but we do have a bye week in between here, so that's kind of nice. Uh, we have it week ten, 
it says it right down here. So in between the Texans and the Chargers, we do have a bye week. But um, this little stretch at the end here is what I'm worried about. Texans, Deshaun Watson will be back. Uh, I, with Deshaun Watson, if he is um, healthy, I think the Texans are a very good team. So that's something to watch out for. Chargers, I think, are going to be... Um, I think us and the Chargers are going to be battling to win the division. Um, so they're definitely a team to watch out for. Plus, we are going to uh, play them. We don't have a home game against them that week. And then the Steelers. Um, Steelers are obviously a good team. So are the Bengals, um, both in the same division. But I, I think those... These two for sure are, are L's to me. Um, maybe not the Bengals, but Steelers, I just see us losing. Uh, I, I don't know, but that's just how I'm feeling. And then the 49ers with Jimmy Garoppolo, I think that could be a good matchup. But 49ers, um, very, a lot, a lot better than last year. Well, the beginning of last year. And then the Browns, I, I really can't say anything on this because now the Browns are stacked. Um, from the off season, but we don't know how they play like that. Totally don't know um, how that would be. So I, I really can't say with the Browns how because we really have no idea how good the Browns are gonna be at this point. So yeah, then we play um, the Raiders uh, as an away game. So that that's gonna be interesting game as well. Um, I I, th I could see us losing that game. And then we play the Chargers at home, which I, I, I think this could be an interesting game because that that could determine, um, I'm just guessing at this point, this is so early uh, to be guessing this stuff, the draft doesn't even happen, but um, I, I would say that, again, totally just guessing, but if me, us and the Chargers fighting for div the division, I think this would be a very important game. Uh, so this might be an important game at the end. I don't know. All right, so this was a pretty short video, but I did want to go over the Broncos schedule since it was released, and um, I'm actually uploaded twice this week, so I, I guess that's fair. Um, you guys might have been expecting a reading your comments video because I said uh, next week will be a reading comments video, um, but it's not next week yet. So, because I, I released a video on um, Thursday, I believe last week. Um, forget what it was about, but in a reading comments video. I did a reading comments video Thursday, and then on Monday I uploaded the Santa Fe vlog, uh, so those videos were really close together, and now I'm uploading this, so I think it should be fair, and then next week I'll upload the reading comments video. So that's just the scheduling for the channel for the next few weeks. Um, so yeah, that's all I have for you for now. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Uh -huh. Never Broncos, they the truth. Quick to hit you with the mind, I salute. Got the doubters and the haters on mute. From head to foot, draped out in orange and blue.